Hey everybody, this is Gunter. We just showed you uh, last video how to update Steam Workshop upload. Now we're going to show you how to upload file to Steam Workshop on uh, Killing 4. We're going to start a new one. Um, do you want to say, eh, who cares? Alright, now we have this. Let's build a really fast a box, I guess. Um, let's build. It doesn't matter what it is. Nope. Oh, sorry guys. Now we really just do a spawn point. Add player spawn and we really be build all. Oh no. Let us go back. Let's start a new one actually. Go high on um, 750. Now, let's go text right here. Let's do it here. Now, you want to go here, there. Um, player spawn. Now, let's do path notes. Ah, no. Now let's add a light. Now we're gonna do build all. Okay. Now save. Uh, I just named that. Hello. Oh no. We wanna save it. We just messed up. Uh, K F underscore. There, now we want to go upload. Upload file to Steam Workshop. Let's do it here. Now, right here. That's the one we just did. Um, let's just. Oh. Now, let's just do private. Friends is only friends can see. Private is for admins and that. And whoever worked on it. And public is a public. Um, map. And let's upload. Now it's successfully. Now let's go over here. Let's go to my workshop profile. This is the one I do my main Steam account. Um, and I actually have a other one for Kiln for Custom. And look, it's right here. And this is the map I just uploaded. You can add the pictures and that. Thanks for watching. This is Kilnshirt. And in the video, have a good day.